string 1 without x. Given a string, if the first or last characters are x, return the string without those x characters, and otherwise return the string unchanged. So let's go over the sample cases. So first there is x, h, i, x. The first character is x, the last character is also x. Upon removing those characters, we get the string h, i. Next we have the string x, h, i. The first character is x, the last character is not x. We only need to remove the first character, and upon doing so, we get the string hi. Here, the first character is not x, the last character is x. After removing the last character, we get the string hxi. So how do we solve this problem? So first we need to check if the length of the substring is greater than zero. This is just a safety check, because if, um, if we look for a character that does not exist, we will get an error. So if the string is not empty, then we check if the first character equals x. If it is, then we make the substring str the substring 1 str the length. This basically means we remove the first character. Next, we have the case if str the length is greater than 0, again, just to make sure that the string is not empty. If it is empty, again, um, when we ask for, when we try to retrieve an element, we will just get an error. So we check the last character, uh, so, like so, and if it is equal to x, then we remove that character. Like so. Finally, we return the substring, or the string. Um, note that here we use if statements, because both of these conditions might be true, so we want it to pass through both. And if you run it, it works.